Hey there, this is Lana's Enchanted Sky, your spiritual fairy godmother, bringing you your reading for what you need to know for July for Capricorn. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading hypnosis, whatever I do. Um, we are going to Sedona. So if you are interested, um, put in, it's, it's the, I'm only having you register for the class. I will help you secure lodging. I do have um, blocks of places. I It just came out of the clear blue. I decided I wanted to take a class on spoon bending and all the people, but said, I'm going to meet you. I want to meet. And I'm like, okay, let's do it. So um, right now in September 10th and 11th, the more information's on my website. So visit my website um, and I will help you secure lodging. You'll have to get your own plane ticket, but they're dirt cheap. I got 130 bucks round trip from Chicago. So check me out. All right. Joke of the day. Joke of the day is I can, I can do this because I've lost 70 pounds so far. So not quite 70. Anyway, um, so what do you call a pudgy, a pudgy, uh, a pudgy psychic? A four chinned teller. Get it? All right. So here we go. All right. Meditation with a new start, some healing. Ooh, there's a lot of spirituality going on this month. There is a new meeting. There is an ending, a pleasant ending, and you're getting your wish, which is the most important thing. All right. So, you know, you need to keep going forward. And there is a there's a little bit of a fear of being down and out, but it's a spirituality thing that you're trying to get over. You're wondering if there's going to be a new start, and there is. There is a new emotional start with a lot of just kind of make garbage you might have to get through this month. Now, this is written. There's something written coming to you that's worth a lot of money. There's a lot of money involved in it. It's written. It could be a contract. It's something. Pay attention, all right? And it is, it is, it is being blessed. Remember, this is the four corners of the universe blessing this coming full circle with something new to start. So it has to do with the death card, which is the death card. You've been meditating and you've been wanting things to happen for a while, kind of waiting for things, I believe. And it's going to speed up a lot here in July. It's going to happen. And it is so much what you want. It's going to cut you. It's going to set you, set yourself free with this. Set yourself free with this. Okay. Because it's going to, and I'm telling you, it could be, oh God, you got the happy family, happily ever after card too. So this could be family based. It can be somebody that's in your family. I, it's, this is just a really good reading. And I'm a Capricorn rising. This is good. And it's money based. There's money. There's the, the, this is the potential for a very large amount of money to come to you. And any opportunity, if it were me, which it is, <laughs> any opportunity that comes your way this month, anything, anything, take it, take it because it's the darkest before the dawn. So something's looming. It's like done, ready to start. It's your wish. What is your wish? What is your wish? Cause that's what's going to happen. Cause you're going to, it's going to be granted. Now they're also telling you that you're expecting stuff to be a little hidden or a little confusing right now. And there will be some verbal communication a little bit. So there's all kinds of communication going on. So I want you to pay attention to this and make this happen for yourself. All right. It is a new start. All right. Let me show you the cards because this is a really, really good reading. Hmm. Let's, let's look right. at it. So yeah, look at that card. Look at, look at the money and the new start, the wish granted, the ending. I mean, this is just a So really I'm going to pull some angel cards and uh, this is just thoughts that go kind of with it. I always pull through that two decks. Okay. An angel of solitude. You need to be by yourself so you can think clearly. That simple. Okay. Angel of the night sky represents you dreaming, getting messages at night, and just thinking. Just thinking. It's interesting that I'm getting both of them. Now this has to do with love. Now this is self love. Now they've got this as romantic, but I don't. I consider it self love, loving your life, loving just love in general, and you need to. Remember that. I also have the angel of grounding. Stay grounded, logical, sensible. Don't make any rash decisions. Think everything through. How is that? Blessings to you. Make it a great month. And how can you make the planet a better place?